As China's information and communication technology giant, ZTE has gradually emerged in the development of the information industry in recent years, effectively challenging the United States' technological dominance. Especially in the field of databases, the distributed database GoldenDB developed by ZTE has surpassed the established American giants and successfully replaced their database applications in finance, e-commerce, and other industries. The rise of ZTE is inseparable from the rapid development of China's information industry and also highlights the innovation capabilities and technological strength of Chinese enterprises. In the past few decades, Chinese companies have been storing their data in the databases of American companies, such as Oracle's Oracle, IBM's DB2 and Microsoft's SQL Server. However, with the rapid development of China's e-commerce, the needs of databases have changed, and traditional relational databases can no longer meet the needs of data storage and application. The emergence of distributed databases provides Chinese companies with an opportunity to surpass American giants. Distributed databases disperse data storage among different branches and can theoretically be infinitely scalable. ZTE began research and development of distributed databases in 2014 and launched GoldenDB a few years later. The emergence of GoldenDB has received great attention and expectations from the financial system. In 2019, Citic Bank migrated the database of its core credit card business system from IBM's DB2 to ZTE's GoldenDB, achieving a strong replacement for the American giant. Subsequently, ZTE GoldenDB successively provided database support for core business systems for financial institutions such as China Construction Bank, China Everbright Bank, Guangfa Bank, and Shandong Mobile. These cooperation not only enable China's financial system to get rid of its dependence on U.S. databases, but also enable ZTE's position in the database field to increase day by day. In addition to the financial industry, ZTE GoldenDB is also expanding and deploying in other industries, such as ports, customs, transportation and energy. By providing stable and efficient database services, ZTE GoldenDB provides strong support for information management and data analysis in these industries. Public information shows that since its establishment 38 years ago, ZTE has owned more than 80,000 patents worldwide, has business in more than 160 countries, and serves a quarter of the world's population. The rapid rise of ZTE proves the strength of Chinese enterprises in the field of information and communication technology, and also brings new opportunities and hopes for the development of China's information industry. The reason why ZTE can successfully replace American giants is inseparable from the support of its strong technical strength and innovation capabilities. As a leading domestic information and communication technology company, ZTE has always been committed to independent research and development and innovation. By continuously investing funds and human resources, ZTE actively promotes scientific research and technological innovation and has achieved a series of important research results. ZTE's technical strength is mainly reflected in three aspects, chip technology, operating system technology and database technology. First of all, ZTE has made significant breakthroughs in chip technology. As the core component of electronic equipment, chips play a vital role in the development of information and communication technology. ZTE has invested a lot of resources in chip research and development and has achieved a series of important chip technology breakthroughs. In the field of mobile communications, ZTE's 5G chips have been successfully used in 5G base stations and terminal equipment at home and abroad, and have achieved significant advantages in technical performance and stability. In addition, ZTE has also actively explored and innovated in fields such as artificial intelligence chips and Internet of Things chips. Secondly, ZTE also has deep strength in operating system technology. The operating system is the core of computer software and plays a key role in the application and development of information and communication technology. ZTE has independently developed a series of operating systems, such as High Performance Operating System, ZXOS, Secure Operating System, Max, and Intelligent Operating System, ZXIOS. These operating systems have good stability, security, and compatibility, and have been widely used in ZTE products and solutions. Finally, ZTE also has outstanding performance in database technology. 
The advent of the distributed database GoldenDB has provided strong support for ZTE's rise in the database field. GoldenDB's application architecture subverts the traditional relational database and improves the performance and scalability of the database through distributed storage and computing. In the financial and e-commerce industries that have high performance and reliability requirements, GoldenDB has successfully replaced the database solutions of American giants and become the new favorite in the industry. The rise of ZTE not only brings huge opportunities to China's information industry, but also brings a series of new challenges. As the world's largest information consumption market, China's demand for information and communication technology has maintained rapid growth. ZTE's core competitiveness in the field of information and communication technology has been verified, but in the face of the pressure of international competition and technological innovation, ZTE still needs to continue its efforts. First of all, ZTE needs to continue investing in technology research and development and innovation. Today, information and communication technology is developing at a rapid pace, and traditional technological advantages may be quickly surpassed by other companies. ZTE should continue to increase its efforts in technology research and development and improve its ability of independent innovation to seize market opportunities. Secondly, ZTE needs to continuously improve the quality and services of its products and solutions. Competition in China's information and communication market is fierce, and users have increasingly higher requirements for product quality and service quality. ZTE should actively improve its products, improve user experience, provide users with better services, and establish its brand image. Finally, ZTE should also actively explore international markets and expand overseas business. The competitiveness of Chinese information and communication technology companies in the international market continues to improve, but there is still a certain gap compared with international giants. ZTE can take advantage of the Belt and Road Initiative and other international cooperation opportunities to actively expand overseas business, enhance international competitiveness, and further expand market share. Overall, the rise of ZTE proves the strength and potential of Chinese enterprises in the field of information and communication technology. The successful application of the distributed database GoldenDB has enabled Chinese companies to get rid of their dependence on the databases of American giants and have the ability to independently master key technologies. ZTE has strong capabilities in chip technology, operating system technology, and database technology, and continues to invest in R&D and innovation, making positive contributions to the development of information and communication technology. However, ZTE is also facing competition and challenges. It needs to continuously improve its technical strength, improve product quality and service levels, explore international markets, and achieve a higher level of development. As ordinary people, China should give ZTE more encouragement and support, believing that they can live up to their name and achieve more brilliant achievements.